Next recipe is a whole wheat flour tortillas. For the whole wheat flour tortillas, you need one cup whole wheat flour, one cup unbleached white flour, half teaspoon sea salt, one tablespoon soy milk powder, one tablespoon of nutritional yeast flakes, one fourth cup olive oil, and three fourths cup hot water. Do you know you have to have a, a tortilla for the Mexican dishes? Hey Amen. It's right? almost like a bread. Almost like a American people has a bread. And Korean or Chinese people has a rice, mm -hmm. and uh, Hispanic people has to have the flour tortillas. But most of them are white flour uh -huh. with uh, partially hydrogenated oil in it, which is animal lard. Yeah. It will clog your arteries, and some has baking soda. And baking soda is very harmful to your nerve system, your blood, your stomach, and even destroy your vitamin B. So. I'm, I'm going to show you how to make a healthy <coughs> tortilla. Can you, can you buy some of these uh, tortillas in a grocery store? Like yes, the, they do. Uh -huh. They have uh, all kinds. Of, now these days, they have uh, all kinds of flour tortilla, even like a spinach tortilla and even whole wheat tortilla. Mm -hmm. But read the ingredients. Sure, read. They contains all contains baking soda. Mm -hmm. And uh, I don't really like Do they have it. a whole wheat maybe without the baking soda? Or no, I don't find anything okay. without baking soda. I don't know why they have to put it on anyway. Okay. okay, let's go and start. All right. So I'm using a whole wheat flour, one cup here. And the whole wheat flour is called the king of grain. And the very wholesome flour with the fibers. Uh -huh. And the vitamin B1 and B2, B6. And the calcium, magnesium, and, yeah, and iron. Iron, man. This is um, bleached white flour. Amazing, huh? Yes. Then I'm going to add sea salt with 52 minerals in it. <laughs> okay. You can get this where? Health food store. Health food store, okay. And this is uh, soy milk powder. And I'm where do you get the soy milk powder at? Oh, it has to be health, health food, food store. store. And the nutritionist flex, and okay. you, you can get it from health food store too. Why don't you use regular salt? Regular salt contains some uh, dextrose, which is refined white sugar. Okay. And sometimes they put baking soda okay. in the regular So this is salt. a lot more healthier for you. Healthiest one. Healthiest one out there. Yeah, healthiest Amen. one out there. And very low in sodium also. Okay. Yeah. You don't okay. Need that. So after that, I'm going to go ahead and uh, turn this one. Because I need a hot, hot pan. Okay. This is uh, olive oil. What's uh, olive oil? Un unrefined oil? You know, there's, most of the oils are refined, uh -huh. but uh, there's three, diff three kinds of oils. It's unrefined, it's olive oil, walnut oil, uh -huh. and the sesame oil, they're unrefined. So uh -huh. even though you're taking it, uh, using an oil, it's like a wholesome. Oh, wow. And really uh, good for your heart. Yeah. And it promotes low your cholesterol. Cholesterol reduces what? Breast cancer? Breast cancer, wow. this is what they say, and then also protect the livers. Yes. And uh, when you are const constipated, yeah. and when you get up in the morning with an empty stomach, Amen. go and take a two tablespoon olive oil, it will fix Pick you. you up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to just take this one out. Okay. Then make a dough. Okay. It looks good. Okay. This is a nice machine there. Well, now I have to use the hand. Okay. Somehow. Oh. <laughs> mm. Little dry? Little dry, yeah. somehow. I don't know why. I need a little more water. Can you find me some more? I oh, will just put some little more oil in there. Okay. Yeah. They're really dry. Ooh. Okay. I got your message. <laughs> Getting hot. Amen. <laughs> okay. Actually, this is not my recipe. The lady from Mexico, uh, she shared this recipe with me. Mm. And uh, I was looking for really healthy whole wheat flour tortilla recipe, and uh -huh. I was so happy. And it really works good. Okay. It tastes really good. Yeah. You my just... grandson Malachi loves them. And what they usually do with the flour tortilla? They usually make fajita. Fajitas. Yeah. 
Okay. You, you can make anything. You can put refried beans in there, make it like a burrito. Burritos, yeah. You can do all kinds of okay. things. Okay. Maybe you can divide it about 10. One. So make sure that I divide it right this time. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hey, <laughs> got it. <Yeah>. Nine, ten. <laughs> Good job. Okay. Try it again. Try again. Amen. It has to be kind of hot. Too. Yeah. I'm going to spray some uh, spray oil on cut this cutting board. Then you just flatten like this, and then you need to just roll out really thin. They go all the way around. It gets bigger and bigger as you roll it. Yeah. <coughs> okay, this is a homemade, so you don't have to worry about if it doesn't come out very good. And it's still going to be benefit for you. Yeah. It okay. tastes really wonderful. Okay. Okay. Roll out thin is very important. Okay. How about that? I think it is pretty good. That's good. Yeah. Okay. Then put it on the hot pan. And when you cook, I'm going to go with this little bit here. here. Is it lower? Okay. How about, that? How about that? Right there. And then when you see, start it as a bubble, then it's time to turn it over. Then it will be ready. While I'm cooking, I'm going to roll another one. Okay. See, maybe I can make a better one. <laughs> this one. <coughs> that one doesn't look too mm. good. <laughs> it tastes good, though. Okay. Maybe roll out. Like this. Okay. This one I'm doing better. Yeah. Now, I love to make a fajita with this one. Or you can cook some uh, tofu, scrambled tofu, and then you can just wrap it up. Yes. And, okay. So many dishes you can make with it. Okay, it looks like getting ready. Yeah, it's bubbling. Yeah, let's turn it over. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. This one doesn't freeze very good, so I'll ask you to go ahead and make it and eat it right away. Mm -hmm. And while I'm making this one, letter, do we got another letter? Yeah, one more letter here. Okay. And she's Verna, and she says, Dear Kyung, it's, it is time I wrote to tell you how much I appreciate your cookbooks. I have missed you on 3ABN, but I found your recipes on its archives of recipes. I want to tell you how much I especially like your walnut gluten recipe. My family just loves it. Again, thank you, and may God bless you as you continue to share the wonderful, healthy recipes. Yours in Christ, Verna. Oh, amen. Thank you, Verna. And I don't know where Verna's from, but okay. we love you, and we thank you for the letter. Okay, maybe uh, you can mention about where they can get all this recipe from 3ABN, right? Yes, you can, you can write to, or call 3ABN, or you can get on 3ABN.org, and you can uh, request and look at their uh, archives of uh, recipes, and you can download them to 3abn.org. Yeah. Or you can, you know, like Kyung said earlier, you can get us through our website at kyungcw.com. All right. Uh, All right. We got a finished product we'd like you to show you. have a finished product we'd like to show you at this time. Hey, Amen. Doesn't yeah. that look good? Yeah. That one came out real good. Hey, Amen. <laughs> Thank you. It tastes good. Yeah, we 